Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello, my name is Siti Ajo Arsad I'm from English Literature In this video, I will tell you about two traditional games Traditional game are very important for us to preserve how old or one just start create a traditional game that we often played when we were young in children and improve cognitive intelligent motoric children traditional game is a game that is a traditional tool to be one of the uniqueness and distinctive characteristic of Indonesia therefore is a very important for each generation to keep preserving traditional culture king of the traditional game first game is karel sintir in the sundanese area this game is very popular usually it can be played by girls and boys as for how to play rubber rub which is followed by two or more players in the determine who is the first to play usually by sweeten or curtain before starting the games, you must first agree on the rules. Continue to plug one long stick for twice and one and one short side stick to determine the entry of rubber. If the rubber is centered by above, then into a small bamboo blade, then the players can take the rubber and will winner. And the second traditional game is a grang. In the determine where the winner is by saying bamboo. Stomping for fill is made a few inches under the stick. Usually, this game is made in ages 17. Usually, who has the stick and the father step. And will was when the player sets for the ground. Their game can be followed by at least two people. In Sundanese, this game is called by jajangkungan. In traditional game, there are culture elements, a culture element among them. Children in ancient time called develop and preserve, preserve traditional game from generation to generation, although not long lasting long lasting they can also create new types of games that are often played with their village friend maybe enough from me uh, thank you and wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh